Okay, what's going on everyone on YouTube and Twitch? This is very Melon Man, welcome back to the Pokemon Yellow Legacy Let's Play. Last episode, we defeated Koga, who rightfully came in Badge, the Soul Badge. And because of that, we're now one step closer to well, one step closer to the Pokemon League. It's a new step every day. Now, we did that using a team of Primeape, Pidgeot, Venusaur, Blastoise, Charizard, Pikachu. But at this point in the game, we're also going to change things up because... My windows are closed. That was just a plane. We're changing things up because... As you also saw in the previous episode... I have a Cloud Ghastly and a Snorlax. Evolved them off camera. And since there's only one Pokemon under overlay that will be evolving, hopefully the overlay won't suffer a minor glitch and not update our team. But yeah, Haunter, Nose, Confuse Ray, Poison Gas, Side Wave, and the new, more powerful Nightshade. Super important because it's only stab move. Snorlax, on the other hand, has headbutt, harden, and rest. Bat. We can't Snorlax. We see that it starts with amnesia. Headbutt, harden, and rest. Oh, amnesia. You know what? The fact that it starts with amnesia is a good thing because it means you can display. Surfing Pikachu right again. And this is what we're left with. So, the reason for this. And no, you can't suit up your surfing speed in the water. So we're down here, not because we are going to be taking advantage of anything else except this, but because there is a move reminder. It's in the last room. There we go. Our moves are forgot. But we're going to teach Snorlax to remember Amnesia. Because it's sick. to remember that <clears throat> is because Amnesia lets Snorlax shore up its really bad defenses. Headbutt. Alright. And now we can check the Codex again. That's also Snorlax gets. 5743, that's nice. Um... I guess they'll let you play thrower as well. Okay. So.
All right. Oh, you know what? Uh, well, we're, this one's gonna be a bit of a, a long one anyway. Old body just attacks all. Just attack. Unabashed increases speed. And soul badge increases defense. So, with three badges, any move we have that increases. <clears throat> with three badges, any move we have that improves any of our buffs, any of our stats will also. buff our attack, speed, and defense. So. Let's see. Another way fly hip up on the way. Yeah, so. Jilly now gives Pikachu a badge boost that greatly enhances its speed. In addition to the fact that it can take advantage of badge boosts. giving me two turns of sleep, plus amnesia to double boost up and give me batch boosts in addition to everything else is just incredible. Everyone gets a new move at level 36. So I guess I'm wondering what is going to be on...
Okay. All right. I don't really know what else to do except just grind up. Because right now, we're pretty much really weak. Yes. I guess we're just cleaning up the left hand side of this whole area, really. Stop and think about it. I don't have this is I've tried to it's kinda hard not to like make these feel like grinding episodes, grinding, grinding episodes, but that's what they are. I have no idea why you have unevolved Pokemon. It's weird. I have no idea, but as you can see, Haunter kicks ass as usual. Both of them. Okay. 
I hope you mean your Pokemon needs to learn better moves, sir, because... Jane is just great coverage, really. I know those people were made for Pikachu to fight, but it just seems weird. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> yeah. The grind grind. Pretty much what this episode is. Really, we get right down to it. Speed reductions are basically just... Damn you, Redfall. Also, oh my freaking god. There's so much to talk about. Ubisoft clo Microsoft closing Tango Filmworks and Redfall and the uh, Arcane Austin for no godforsaken reason. Other than being sh shareholder dates. Damn it, Aqua. Yeah, I'm alright. Alright. 
Yeah, I'm alright. Red. Character there. There and Natsu is super sad. It's just At this point, I'm just slowing down so that you guys can, like, experience actual music here instead of the speed-up nonsense. Garbling all the sound. Because that's the real problem with episodes that are entirely about grinding. You fundamentally don't get to see real gameplay. We're just clearing out trainers. There's a real question of whether or not it's even worth showing episodes where I don't do anything. That's pretty much why I sometimes do double-upload episodes where... Is there stuff going on? Now, again, PG doesn't boost its special until after we get Blaine's badge, which is why special badge boosts, so... And even Tail Whip makes our strength go up even higher. Damn it. That was a crit, so I can't tell. That's pretty much the only problem with these badge boosts. If you crit, the boost itself is ruined, so you can't really tell what's going on. I think the weird part is that I guess it's because you could technically take care of the Snorlax from Vermilion or Celadon, so that's why the 
the XP is scaled and the difficulty is scaled up to that degree. This is where you get the last super rod. We don't need to do anything about that one, so we'll teach Fly Charizard. It's just attack. Technically, you're not supposed to fight these guys until after, I believe, you get Sabrina. Her badge. But level 40 is where you need to be at, anyway. Amnesia. You're faster. Special great errors. Snorlax being able to learn Rest, Harden, and Amnesia definitely causes it to become a bit of a one-trick pony. But putting Rest on as many free slots as we can is pretty good. Testament to how high that special stat was actually raised, that Snorlax survived all that. Alright. Well, that taken care of. I think the only thing left to do now is to just head over to... The only thing left to do now, straight up, is finally start the entire Slifco arc. <laughs> 